Hello, welcome back. This is another tutorial for Photoshop CS4. Uh, today we're going to do a simple tutorial on how to straighten your horizon or how to fix a horizon. Uh, many of you have taken pictures that you thought were great and you really happy that you got the picture, but then you come back and you realize that you have a slanted horizon like we see in this photograph here. So I'm going to show you a quick fix. It's been around for a while now in Photoshop uh, to have you uh, adjust this and, and get that horizon nice and straight. I'd like to start by unlocking our first uh, layer right here. Double click on the lock icon, say OK. And as usual, uh, I like to make a copy of this layer by hitting Command J and we can have the topmost layer active, make sure it's highlighted in blue. And um, the tool that we're looking for to make this adjustment in Photoshop is the ruler tool. And the ruler tool lives underneath this eyedropper tool over here. If you haven't seen it, it sits right here on the side in your toolbar. Sorry about that. And if you click on it, you can see that you can drop down and select the ruler tool. So let's do that and let's zoom back out here. So we've got our ruler tool selected Underneath, again, there's another uh, drop menu here, which is where all the other tools are located inside of that one. And now that we have a ruler tool, what I'd like to do is um, click on the edge of the picture where the horizon is, and let's follow it. Even though it is crooked or it's slanted, let's follow it all the way, because it, this is going to tell Photoshop how to make the adjustment and by what degree this kind of slant is somewhat off. So I'm dragging it around just to the edge here, and I let go. Now that that's done, what we can do is come up into the image menu way at the top here, drop down and hit image rotation, and drop over and go to arbitrary. And what that does is tell you the degrees uh, by which this uh, horizon is off. Uh, I think the default that comes on is counterclockwise, and that's selected. If it's not, you can select it, and just press OK. And what you'll notice is that Photoshop makes the adjustment to the picture and tilts it. What we're left with is the background uh, that shows through. The background here, in my case, I have it set to this kind of small check plaid. And you can see that now we've rotated the picture, but I can see the background. So what we have to do to uh, finalize this is to make a crop. I like to make a crop at least in the same dimensions that the picture is in. I don't know if you can see this on the bottom, but the dimensions of this picture are roughly 14 inches by 11 inches at 180 dpi. So what I'm going to do is grab my crop tool over here in the sidebar, and I have set up 14.4 by 10.88 just to keep the dimensions the same, and my resolution at the top is set to 100 dpi. Start at the top corner with your crop tool and drag it all the way out until you start to kind of get on the edge where that background checkered plaid is and then let go of the mouse. What you can then do is move this and get it into position here and we can kind of make sure that we avoid this background in our crop. We can stretch it out a little bit further and you want to keep uh, looking at the edges here to make sure we don't actually grab any of that. So I'm up at the top left corner and I see that we're fine in the bottom corner, we're fine here and we can just say OK to that adjustment by checking the checkbox, clicking once up there. Photoshop does is it takes care of the distortion, uh, at least in the uh, horizontal uh, positioning of this photo, and fixes that horizon based on how we stretched out that ruler tool. So that is a quick fix for how to fix a crooked picture if you didn't get to line it up. I hope you enjoyed it. Try it a couple times on some pictures and take your time with it. And we'll see you here again for another tutorial.